hey hey my beautiful beautiful people what's up i love you guys right hope you're shining bright not letting anybody dim that light right that's what's up my name is trinity and welcome to my channel all about the healing ah all right so this is a bonus 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 but let me get into it. Let, uh, my little intro. I'm just going to do a little intro. Because we're we going to get short and to the point. My ride and dies. My new subscribers. My uh, energy exchange tips, donations, whatever you want to call it. To you. Whatever you sow on this channel, you shall reap. And that is so 100, 10, 20, 100, 40, right back at you, right? And thank you for all who have donated. And thank you for all that want to donate. Just go to the description box. All of the information is there. All right. On the flip side, looking good, smelling good like I should. Can't stop. Ain't going to stop. And won't stop nothing up in here. Whatever I got going on here. I'm here to stay. You ain't getting ready to rock no boat. You ain't getting ready to stop no show. We The show will go on. Because it ain't about me. But it's everything about him. Alright. Now. It is so. So be it. I say. Samote B. Alright. So we are honored to sign up. Bam! There it is, Taurus. And you know what, Taurus? I just want to um, thank you for all your support. You're one of my biggest supporters. Your um, your beautiful comments. Um, thank you for rocking with a sister. Okay. Um, thank you for loving me, supporting me. Um, all your beautiful comments, positive energy, all your donations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You are much appreciated and loved by me. All right. So this could be for Taurus, Sun, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. This could be for the cross watcher. So that means I said Taurus, but if this cross watcher or if you are coming here giving me positive vibes and loving on me i love you back just be in the right energy just be uh, uh, you know in the right energy and doing the right thing if you on here uh trying to come here so you can harm somebody come here so you can project onto somebody you can move on with that i'm not talking to you okay i'm talking to those y'all know who i'm talking to that's enough said, because I ain't got enough time. But, uh, Cross Watcher, anybody that have Taurus in their chart, and anyone who resonate with the title, click on here, it's your reading. It's your reading. It doesn't matter if you're a Taurus, or you're involved with a Taurus. If you resonate with the title, it's your reading. Alright, so let's get into it. Alright, so this is a bonus read for you guys. Because you have been showing out. So, I needed to do, put some car out some extra time for you. Okay. All right. Your overall energy is. Um, okay. So this overall is um, of the sea. I'm gonna give you all the cards and then I'm gonna read. Creation. Inspired. Inadequate. And thief in the reverse but thief is not good whether it's okay with this to the c i was trying to figure out what the, what, what this energy is but I, I i think i have it this message is going to be for people or the collective who have healed have grown um, you've tapped into your your gifts, your abilities. Um, 
You're very strong. You're very strong. Whoever you are, you're very strong. And you've been through hell. You've been through a lot. Okay. Um, hold on. Hold on a second. This light is a little bit better. Okay. Um, you've healed. You've did the transformation. You, you, you are a chosen one. Just to put it to your chosen, you are a psychic, you are a healer, you are, um, you've made major changes, you transform, you just, you have, you are the one, you're the chosen one, you're the chosen one, you are the one that has been targeted, ran down, stalked abused you you're chased you you you're you're you are someone that when i talk about the pest you're the one that the pest is pestering <laughs> um in this card though you have someone that has been watched stalked talked about ran down but this person is strong, very strong. Everything that's been thrown to this person, thrown at this person, this person has been able to transmute the pain, transmute the hurt, transmute the energy to something positive. This is a very powerful person, but this person is moving in another direction. And what I'm getting from this, this new direction is a, this new direction is a new level. Um, but what I'm getting, cause see here, see how this person has their wings. They sit, they're sitting in here and they're moving, um, they're moving along and the divine is right here watching them. So what this is is somebody the chosen one is taking a break um they're taking a break from from everybody they're taking a break from the pest they're taking a break from ex-lovers they're taking a break from new lovers they're taking a break from um whatever spiritual work they're just taking a break they're just sitting in here and they are taking a break. Because at once on one side of the scale, they got all kind of see all this the sea is nothing but emotions. Even though the emotion is, even though all of this is, is study, it's still a lot. When I say that this person that I'm speaking and picking up on, I say this is going to be a short reading, but I can't. It's like I, I'm getting it out, but I can't. This person feels so many people emotions this person has a lot of responsibility they have their family they have their friends then they have all of this negative energy that's constantly coming at them watching them targeting them target targeting them um they feel everything this particular person that i'm talking about is psychic is an empath, has many gifts, talents, and abilities. But at this point in time, they have accepted their calling. They have accepted who they are. That's not the problem and that's not the issue and that's not why they're taking a break. So I'm asking Spirit, what is this all about? Because why... You are, whoever you are, you're moving on. You know these people are watching you. You know, you know, you know all, you know, you know all of this.
could it be that spirit have you? Spirit has you here. You see, there's no, there is no, no land. There's no people. There's no people in sight. You're out of sight. You got these people, you got this here. You can watch them, but they can't watch you. You can see them, but they can't see you. You're out of sight. And spirit placed you out of sight from these people. Spirit placed you in this uh in this hub. Spirit placed what I call it and what I what I call it is um Spirit is hiding you under his wing, hide, uh, hiding you. Um, or Spirit has sent his angels to hide you under their wings, is what I'm trying to say. They're, they're hiding you for a time and for a season. So some of you know that you are in this, in this, um, some of you know you in this predicament. You know that you are in a holding pattern. You know that you're breaking. You know that you are being able to take a break from all. Because this is not anybody coming at you. The seed not don't have any waves. It don't have anything. This is clear, cool, calm, collected. If you look at the picture, she she is... Uh, sitting in here relaxing she may have a book and she's moving in the direction that the spirit that that god is and he's watching her move in that direction making sure she's moving in the direction she's still moving she's still growing she's still but right now it's not the time right now i got you at a holding pattern I ha I got I'm hiding you because there's something going on. Okay, let let me okay. Okay, I got it. I got it. You it's something going on with your creation. Something you created, something you're getting ready to create is being targeted. But the creation and, and, and what it is that's that needs to be created or the creation came from you and it's in you. So Someone, some things, some people are trying to target what you have inside of you that you've already created or is getting ready to create when you reach your destiny. So spirit is hiding you from these people because... Spirit needs you to be strong, needs you to be uh, mentally stable, grounded, and rooted, not, exhaust, not exhausted, um, not weary, not tired, not nothing. Spirit needs to, you to be in a right, in, in a right mental state, in a right way of frame of mind, high vibration. See, they're trying to steal something from you. They're trying to steal something from you, but they can't. That's why it's in the reverse. They can't steal this from you because they can't see you. You, 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 you are now in hiding. You are in hiding. Whoever you are, you are in, in hiding. That's why things seem to be different. Seem, things seem to be off. Um, you don't feel... You feel different. You feel... Um, calm, cool, calm, and collected, but it's different. Um, you're in, you are being hidden. You are being, um, things is going on in the background that spirit don't even want you to be involved in. However, it does make you feel different. It, it does make you, you feel what's going on, but you don't know what's going on. You feel the energy around you, feel like something is not right. However, you still 
you don't know what it is, but you still know that you got to keep going. Is what this is. Um, okay. Let's, let's. The bottom line is this. Somebody trying to steal something. They've been trying to steal something for you for a while, but it's your time. They've been trying to steal. They've been trying to uh, get you to, uh, to trip you up, get you low vibrational, get you uh, to try to hurt you, to try to harm you, to take you out. So this gift, whatever this is that you have. It won't go forward or the gift that you've already started that this creation that you already started that it wouldn't flourish but this whatever it is that this creation this thing because whatever it is is powerful whatever it is is anointed whatever it is is appointed it's your destiny so the thing about it is this these you They've tried to steal this, but they can't. But it's something that's going on behind the scenes that you do not know about. Spirit don't want you to know about it. Spirit just wants you to stay cool, calm, and collected. This is what you need to do. This is what this reading is about. Do not get in your feelings. Do not get depressed. Do not, um, do not, whatever is being projected onto you that's not your energy you need to release it this is not the time to be down in the dumps this is not the time to not know your energy this is not the time to know to take on somebody else's energy to take on somebody else's thoughts to take on this is not the time to be that super empath this is the time to release 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 this is very very important because as i've already stated if you look at this card whatever you have is precious whether you have already started it whether you have not started but you know you're getting ready to start it you're getting ready to prep your body your mind your soul your spirit to start it whatever it is it doesn't matter at this point only thing that matters is spirit is wanting you to know clear release whatever not yours let it go if you get up in the morning you just filling up some type of way you need to find out why if you got money in your bank you got a vehicle you got a place to stay you got uh uh you know if you don't have no reason to be Feeling down in the dumps, everything good to go, everything good, you blessed, then you you got to check that. As soon as you get up in the morning, if something is not right, you got to check it. You got to check that energy and release it because it's not yours. You have no reason to be feel down. You have no reason to be depressed. You have no reason to feel uh, unworthy or you have no reason. You are worthy. You are appointed. You are uh uh you are appointed. You are anointed. You are beautiful inside and out. You got people that's flipping and tripping and going through all kinds of emotions, the wishing woulda, coulda, shoulda. Could they could, could, could they please be in your DM? Could they please give you a call? You got all of this energy around you. You have no reason to second guess this you let nobody second guess this this is what you came down here to do and it's show time it's show time show time to show people who you truly are what you working with and that they have no power no anointing nothing over you and no definitely don't have your permission you will shine you will bring this forth in spite of all that's being done to you in the background, in spite of all that's being prepared, and in spite of all that's put out in the atmosphere, you will outshine all of those things. You will shine bright. You will move forward. Because 
this is what you came here to do. And you have God, the Most High himself, watching over you. You're getting your downloads. You're getting your acknowledgement. You're getting your love. If you feel some type of way, then you need to, you need to get with the Most High. Because that's where all your love is. That's where all your support is. Whatever you need is right here with the Most High God. And if, it's, if you don't call them the most high God, you call them source, divine, universe, whatever you want to call them. You got it right here. Everything you need is right here. Because you have a purpose, you have a destiny, and it overrides anything that anybody got going on concerning you. Anybody feelings, what they want, what they wish, what they... It ain't about them. This never was about them. This was about this. They trying to steal it, but they can't. God has his hands all over you and this gift, and it shall go forth. Nobody's going to stop it. Nobody's going to steal it. These people want to steal want to steal it. They want they want you to go away because you are inspiring people, you are changing people's lives, you are motivating people, you are um you are being a role model, you are uh changing the way people think about themselves. You're changing how people uh, relate to other people. You're changing people. You're, you're putting out positive energy, positive vibration, and you are, inspiring, you are inspiring people to be a better version of themselves. You're doing things that these people could never do, and they want to take it from you, but they can't. Because it's too powerful. It's nothing that they can. It's nothing that they can hold on to. Even if they were to think that they could steal it, they can't hold on to it. They don't know what to do with it. It's too powerful for, for them. It was they haven't been through, they haven't been through any training. See, this person they've been through training, trials, tested, proven. These people don't know nothing about that. They take the easy way out. They try to rob you, steal, kill, destroy, destruction, confuse, bewildered. They try to take, but they don't want to go through, they don't want to go through the training process. What you need to have to be able to carry this creation all the way through. They don't want to do it. They feel inadequate. They are inadequate because they are not trained. They have, they don't have, they don't have the willpower, the stamina, the strength. Because in order to carry, you have to have that strength. You have to be able to have the mental strength, clarity. You have to be able to have the mental uh, stamina. The physical stamina, the uh, willpower, the power source, the determination to be able to carry something like this. If you don't have it, you will never be able to make it. It will get too hard. It will get too hard. The struggle will be real for somebody like this to carry. Because all they know is to steal. All they know is to kill, to destroy. That's all they know. They don't know about going through a hardship or going through a struggle for humanity. They hardships they think is all about money or the heart I can't pay my bill or I don't got this and I don't got that in physical. 
they don't know about struggling and hardship for humanity and for 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 to help others and to lift the to lift other people up see that's senseless to them why would i help you i need to help my own self out they think about them their own self their own self ab above everybody else so they couldn't be able to carry this load it would be too heavy for them to carry because this here is a destiny and a purpose for somebody that's willing to hold it for all you carrying this this load for all to see to have and be able to be inspired For, to motivate, to be able to carry this for somebody else that ain't, you don't know them, they ain't doing nothing for you, they not helping you, but you're heeding the call because it's needed for somebody else. Not for myself, not for my family, but for somebody else to get it. You're inspiring. These people don't know how to do that. They're all about themselves. They want to steal it, but they can't. They can't. They are, they are inadequate. They cannot carry this load. They can't. All right. So... For those of you that's in this situation that's feeling like they are in a holding pattern, what's going on, I'm confused, did I do something wrong? You didn't do anything wrong. Is that things need to be at a standstill right now. Things need to be, things is moving and shaking in the background on your behalf because you're getting ready to move out. You're getting ready to accomplish something. Something's about to blow up. Something's about to, whatever you build and whatever you're doing, spirit is hiding you for a time because spirit needs you to be rested. Spirit needs to you to be rejuvenated. Spirit needs your vibration to be high. And these people that's coming at you, they want the opposite. They want you low vibrational, depressed, upset. They want to project, project, project. But you're high. You, you're being hidden. They can't find you. They can't see you. But you can see them. You see everything they're doing. So if you can see everything they're doing, Spirit is giving you this message. You can see them. So if you can see what they're doing, release all that foolishness that they're doing. Release that. That's not your energy. That's their energy. Don't get stuck in, stuck up in that. That's not for you. Stay, stay in your energy high vibe. Stay doing the work. Keep your mind clear. Clarity. Let go of confusion. If anything confusion let confuses you, let it go. It's not for you. It's not your, it's not your, it's not about you. You need to let that, because nothing right now is about confusion. Everything is cool, calm, collected. Everything. Your spiritual message is family connections. So spirit, what spirit is saying, it says respect, people, and kinship. Family connections. So what I'm getting what I'm getting from here is this you also have your ancestors. Your ancestors are also involved in this. Your ancestors are also trying to contact you to speak to you to keep you grounded. So spirit is watching you and watching your gift, but your ancestors is blocking these people out from seeing you. They, they are not allowed to see you. They are not allowed to touch you. They are not allowed to, to come in your, your energy field. But you still feel them. But they can't see you. 
you could see them. So use that to your advantage. Use everything to your advantage. All your gifts, talents, and abilities. This is the time to use them. They can't. They can't find you. They're trying to find you. They're trying to steal from you, but they can't. They can't find you. You. It's like you escaped. You. You and went. You out to sea. They don't know where you are. They can't find you. But your ancestors are speaking and they're saying that we are with you. Listen, we are with you. We're, we are protecting you. We are uh, standing in the gap for you. We would not allow these people to come at you. We would not allow these people to steal from you. We would not allow these people to take from you. It don't belong to them. It belongs to the bloodline. And we refuse to allow someone to come in and steal from the bloodline. This is a generational thing. This gift you have is a legacy for generations to come. You, you are uh, captivating it. For the generation, for the bloodline, for generations to come. Others will take the ring after you have established it. It's very important that you continue to move forward. We got you. This is this has been your reading. I don't even know what I'm going to call this one. <laughs> it took me so long to get it out. Alright, so anyway, this has been your reading. Hit the comments. Uh, let a sister know how she did. I mean, you know, how she did. Hit the emojis. Let a sister know you're still working with me. <laughs> it was a little slow getting it out because I couldn't understand. Why was you at sea? Why was you at sea? Why, why were you at sea like that? I couldn't understand that. Okay. So, uh, thumbs up, thumbs down. Just thumbs the channel. It helps a sister out, right? Okay, um, subscribe, look guys, subscribe, right? When you subscribe and you tap into me, I tap into you. When I go before the throne, like I didn't understand this reading, but if I'm tapped into the collective, if I, I will get it. So if you are subscribed, then I can tap into you. Then I can give out a, a reading. I can I can do the reading if you're tapped in. It takes, um, you know, everybody. If you want a reading that resonates, then, then you need to subscribe. You can't just keep watching, keep watching, and keep watching. Energetically, it don't work like that. You got to subscribe, guys. So... With that being said, when I go before the throne, you will not be included if you're not subscribed. So subscribe. Description box have all the information there. Social media is there. Uh, so go check it out. Um, all my stuff is timeless. My playlist is timeless. Um, it's good stuff out there. Um, not doing any personal readings right now. And so hit the notification bell so you can always know what's up, right? With the channel. Channel. Sending you love. Sending you healing. Trinity is out.